As per popular request, I'm showing you how to get a seed of a world, realm, server, whatever. For this, we're going to be using Odorso Client right over here. This is going to be linked down in the description below if you want to get it. Uh, this will almost always be updated to the latest version, which is obviously fantastic. Um, and this should work across versions as well. Anyways, there are also a few other clients like Horion that have this functionality. Um, however, as you will probably know, Horion isn't really updating currently. Uh, it's been a little slow. And Onyx is a little more consistent with updating. Not sure uh, where my skin went, but... Oh well, that doesn't really matter for this tutorial, I guess. So... You want to open up the chat over here and you can type dot help and then you'll get a list of all the uh, commands that Odorso has. Or you can just simply type directly in dot seed and you'll get the seed of, in this case, the private world. Um, in settings, as you can see over here, we can see that this is indeed the correct seed. Now, I know you guys are going to have questions about this. There we go. I have my skin back now. So the owner of, for example, the... Uh, realm or whatever is not going to see it when you type this in chat. Yes, it does also work on stuff like realms and servers. So I'm here on the hive right now and as you can see the seed has been set to zero on the hive, meaning that when I type in dot seed I will also get the correct value of zero over here. As I said, when you type it in chat, uh, that'll be the only thing that show. As I said, when you type that seed in chat, no one else will be able to see it, and it'll also not show in the server logs, that is, as it is purely client-side, so only for you. And as I said, of course, it also works on Realms too. The owner will not be able to find out. Now, for the rest, for Odor So, uh, you can actually type in the L button on your keyboard, and that'll open up the Click GUI area over here. Um, which has all of the other utilities that this client has too, as well as a bunch of other things. I have a full usage tutorial for this that will be in the description. Um, basically, that's that. Right now, thank you ever so much for watching, and I do of course hope to see you again in the next one. Bye-bye.